Hey, I'm Mark Hunter, the Sales Hunter. You found another episode of the Sales Hunter podcast. What am I talking about right now? Hey, prospecting is an activity. It's not a solution. Now, what do you mean by that? That's a little head spinning. You're right. And I'm going to unpack it and share you, share with you the reasons why and the differences and how to make it work for you. And the show begins right now. Okay, prospecting is an activity, not a solution. What does that mean? I'm Mark Hunter, the sales hunter. First of all, let's unpack the second half of that, not a solution. You see too many people, too many salespeople look at prospecting as a, a solution. In other words, it's a solution they only do when they don't have enough in their pipeline. It's a solution they do when all other attempts to, to sell have failed. It's a, it's a solution to do when when it, it doesn't look like they're going to make their number. It's a solution due when they're absolutely desperate. That is the wrong attitude about prospecting. Prospecting is an activity. Prospecting is an activity. I want you to look at prospecting as if it was a muscle. And think about this. If, if you belong to a gym, you can belong to a gym, but you're not going to get in shape unless you go inside and use the machines, unless you exercise. You see, prospecting is an activity in two different ways. It's an activity that you have to do it with repetition. And it's an activity for the prospect because unless they see you enough, they're not going to engage with you. Too many salespeople, what they do is they view prospecting as, as a solution and they throw out a whole bunch of emails. They throw out hundreds of emails, thousands of emails, and they get one or two bites and then they run with it and they forget about all the others. They, and they never come back to them. In other words, they ghost they're, they're prospects. They, oh, well, not even, they're not prospects. They're really just leads. They're just ghosting their leads. Well, guess what? You're going to be in this, in this, this frantic race to try to figure things out time and time again if you view prospecting as a solution. If you view it as an activity of continuous, this is going back to going to the gym. You go to the gym every day. You go to the gym every day for a week or two, and you really don't see any difference. You might start to feel a little different, but you really don't. Nah. It isn't until you routinely are doing it day in and day out for a long period of time that you begin to see the results. This is the same thing with activity in terms of your, your leads. Now, you've qualified your leads and that you know they're good leads, but they're not engaging with you because you haven't been repetitive enough with your reaching out to them, whether that be phone call, voicemail, email, text messaging, social media, or a combination thereof. You see, prospecting is an activity. And when I work with salespeople, and I work with companies who are struggling at getting prospects, struggling getting them. I always I say, let's take a look at the CRM system. Let's look at your cadence. Let's look at what you've been doing. You know what? It, it, it 95% of the time, it's not there. They have not been reaching out. Now, there's 5%, 10% of the time there are other issues. But the vast majority, of them, it's because they've had no repetition. You see, this is why I say prospecting is an activity. This is also why I say don't think that you can prospect 500 people at one time. I was working with some enterprise reps dealing with very large accounts. And each of them had 20 accounts. And then they sit there and say, oh, I need another 50, 75, 100 account. No, you don't. You're enterprise. You have more than enough right there. Now, if I'm SMB, that's a different story. Because again, those are shorter sales cycles, smaller opportunities, et cetera, et cetera. But see, don't sit there for a moment and say my, my solution to prospecting is just to get a boatload more prospects. That's a technical term. No, that's not. It's not going to happen at all. That's a big, fat mistake. What you want to be doing is this. You want to be doing this as an activity. And what does that mean? That actually means less. Undoubtedly, that means fewer prospects than you realize, but it's repetitive. 
It's over and over and over again. See this where I say prospecting is an activity. One final note, and I'll share this, I'll share, I'll unpack this more in future episodes. But what I mean, it's, you know, over and over again. It's not over and over with the same message. Every message must be different. We'll unpack that more in future episodes of the Sales Center podcast. Hey, my name is Mark Hunter, the Sales Center. What is this about? It's about giving you two episodes a week. One, a short, single topic, one like this. And the second, a longer where we do a deep dive. Hey, do me a favor, subscribe, rate, and review the show. Would you leave me a rating? Would you leave me a review for this show on your favorite podcast app? That sure helps tell others about it. The Sales Hunter Podcast. I'm on a mission to help you become the greatest salesperson you can possibly be. And it all begins with prospecting. That's why we're focusing for the next three, four months on these short episodes on just prospecting. I'm Mark Hunter, The Sales Center. One goal for you this week, influence and impact others. Great selling.